Hello friends, welcome back to our YouTube channel Technical Specs. In this specific video, we are going to learn about packages in Java. Like what is a package, why we use a package and how many types of packages available in Java. Package in Java is one of the most important topics in Java. So watch this video till the end. Now without wasting time, let's start the video. So very first, what is a package in Java? A package is a group or we can say collection of classes, interfaces and sub packages of the same type. Don't be confused here, let's try to understand this by real life example. The package is the same as a folder in our windows. We create a folder and save it by name according to what data we are going to store in it right so that we can find that data anytime whenever we want same in java we create groups for the same type of classes and then further we create packages for those groups now so whenever we need to use those classes we can simply use those classes by importing the package so this is why we use packages in java now the next we have types of packages in java in java there are two types of packages the first one is built in packages and the second one is user defined packages let's see the meaning of both the type of package one by one built in packages are the packages from the java api java api is a library of pre written classes that are free to use the library contains components for managing input, database programming and much more. Furthermore, the library is divided into packages and classes. It means we can either import a single class along with its methods and attributes or we can import a whole package that will contain all the classes. So basically we can use it according to our need. So to import a class or a package from the library, we use the keyword import. Like to import a single class, we write it like import package name dot class. Here the package and class name will be any name which you define in your code. Let we want to import a scanner class. So how we write it? Let's see import java.util.scanner here java.util is the package name and scanner is the class name so this will only import the scanner class from the package java.util if you want to know more about scanner class in java then check the link which is available in the i tab and description of this video there you can find the separate video on what is scanner class in java in detail so similar to the java.util package, there are many more built-in packages available in Java like java.lang package, java.io package, java.awt package, java.sql package, etc. We will learn about all these packages in our later videos. Next and to import a whole package, we write it like import package name dot star here star basically refers to all the classes which are there in the package now the next type of package we have is user defined package so let's see user defined package simply means to create our own package so to create our own package first we must use the package in our code name it like package p1 package addition anything we can name it because it is a user defined package we use this package for our own personal use let's try to understand the user defined package by a simple program very first create a folder and the name of the folder will be the name of the package let's say the name is demo inside it first create the java file which will use the same package demo 
like I created a Java file here my package test inside it add the package name first which is package demo and inside it create the class like public class my package test here adding public modifier is simply means to access it publicly anywhere inside it create a method like public void display and then inside it let me want to print this is my package test and let's save it so till yet what we did is we created a package demo here and inside it we create a java file which consists the package demo now in the next step we are going to use this java class file in our different java file using import package so for that very first create here the java file let's say my package demo see here i am not creating this file inside the package demo because it doesn't a part of package demo we just want to use this package in this new java file so here very first we would need to import our own package by using import keyword like import and then package name which is in our case is demo so simply here import demo dot star using star here simply means we can access everything which is in the package demo now create a class here like my package demo create the main method public static void main string args now here we are going to use the property of my package test class because we already import the package so let's see to use that simply create here the object of the class my package test like my package test obj is equals to new my package test and then to access the method display from the class my package test simply call the method here like obj dot display and that's it it will basically call the display method which is inside the class my package test and it will print the required statement which is there in the display method inside the my package test class so let's check it for that first save it in command prompt compile it first like java c my package demo dot java and now run it by entering java my package demo so you can see here it prints the statement this is my package test basically it is coming from the class my package test let add one another print statement here in the my package demo class and check it system dot out dot print ln this is my package demo let's save it and run so now after i run this you can see it prints both the statements the first one is coming from the my package test class and the second one which is this is my package demo is coming from the my package demo class which i just added similarly friends we can create more java classes inside the package demo and can access it by using the import keyword same like creating object first and then we can call methods or attributes so friends this is how we use packages in java if you have any doubt or any question regarding this topic then you can comment in the comment box of this video and last if you find this video helpful then like this video subscribe to our channel if you are new and don't forget to press the bell icon if you want to get the notifications of our more tech videos